Now this is uh, this is my neighborhood here, and uh, yeah, the water seems to be up quite a ways. That's oh, nice. Nice when it gets like this. But anyways, this is right across the street from uh, my apartment. Nice little parkish area here. And uh, let me get on over here and I'll show you the outside of my apartment. Now, did you know that you could get 10 minutes, 10 to 15 minutes of unedited video from my video vault? All you have to do is check out my Patreon page. Link in the description below. And that's it right there. This is where I live. Let me go ahead and cross the street here. And we'll show you what's going on around here. Those are the people who manage it. It's really nice people. Great folks. Get to talk to them a lot. And, uh, Hey, there's my motorbike. Yeah, let's go ahead and check out the inside now. Oh, hey, that's me. <clears throat> this is the reception area. I'll bring you out this way and show you the pool. It's really a cool pool. It doesn't get really warm like some pools around here do because it's totally covered, and that makes it quite nice. A couple places to kick back and get some redhead sun. <laughs> okay. This was a big plus in uh, having an elevator. When I was looking for apartments, there was many of them that I would look saw this beautiful one way up on the fifth floor hey. and um, it was all standalone by itself huge area up there outside area and it was just really really beautiful and although there was no elevators and five flights of stairs was it worth it hmm. I mean it probably lose weight and all that however you don't want to have to tackle that sometimes in this heat. Okay, this is my apartment here. That's a one bedroom. Got my living room there. Very comfortable furniture. And then we'll just go right on into the kitchen area. Got this breakfast nook table type thing that is actually quite, quite high. And, uh, yeah, got everything you need. Even a microwave, two burner stove, double sink. Yay! No dishes in it. And a washing machine. Hang up my drying outside, of course, refrigerator. And I have a little small balcony here. I can kind of see the river from here. Now let's go ahead and go back in here. And this is my computer desk. I wish I had a little bit better of a chair. Here's my air conditioner. One thing in uh, here, so I, I've never used my air con and I've got, I've actually got two air conditioners in here. I've got a decently wide screen TV that I've watched once and that was it I'll come into the bedroom I have another desk here which I have mostly my miscellaneous and uh, photography equipment and things and another little balcony not really much but I'll watch the Sun come up in the morning Actually, I can see the sun coming up in the morning, laying in my bed there. Kind of wakes me up. I get up, up very early. And uh, those are all a uh, closet, like an amwat type built in. OK. 
keep your clothes and stuff in there. Duh. We're going here. And there's the uh, bathroom vanity and another little area over there. And then you just kind of have your standard toilet and um, nice shower. Got one of those rain guys on there. So it's pretty nice. And also it has a door on it, so if you want um, if you want some privacy while you go to the bathroom, you just shut the door here. Um, yeah, I'm still trying to make sense out of that one. <laughs> oh, hey, don't forget to turn off the lights. Come on now. And, uh, hmm, it's really nice, nice, uh, I think it's only about five years old from what I can uh, gather. And I know everyone's wondering how much I pay for this, but let's take a look at one more thing other than this window here that gives me cross breeze. Uh, I also have, we come out this way, and this is what sold me on the place. Wasn't going to go for it, but this is what sold me. Huh. There's this really nice big patio out here. Spend a lot of time out here. It's where I drink my coffee in the morning, overlooking the river. I just got an absolutely beautiful, stunning view of the river. absolutely beautiful in the morning nice view and uh, nice big table and chairs and got another one back there somewhere but um, yeah that's that's what it'd be now you're probably gonna ask me well gosh Kelly how much does that cost well it cost me three hundred and fifty dollars American a month uh, and my utilities um, I usually know not much more than 40 45 dollars a month and that's uh, internet uh, electricity water trash um, like I said I don't use my air conditioner so that's you know that's not too much but if you have your air conditioner on 24 7 like uh, some some people here have, have confided told me about and that's that's running you uh, 150 200 extra a month but um, i got acclimated to this weather as long as i have a, a breeze on me whether it comes off of my my 30 dollars fan or out here where you know wind is free that's yeah, no problem so that's that's what i got here it's uh i mean i could afford it it's a little bit more than what i uh originally had had scheduled for me or budgeted for me to uh to spend but um hey this is my first time living overseas like this so i thought i would splurge so anyways if you're still here you know what i'm gonna say that's right you guys are my number one fan have a great day now and thank you